Jesus is the head. Me and you, we are his body. Born again believer, we are his body. You see, the Bible says he has put all things under your feet. Amen. Hallelujah. I mean, I have authority over them. My, my, she can't even understand. Me and you have authority over Satan. Hallelujah. We are authority over virus. We are authority over disease. We are authority over every besetting sin. Amen. Whatever represents habit. Me and you are in authority. You are seated with Christ. He said, he said, he said, he said he, he was, we are raised with him and seated with him. He said, which he wrote in Christ. When he raised him from the dead, that is the most powerful demonstration of God's power ever in life. Amen. No, pardon, pardon, let's see. It's a small thing. Uh, turning, uh, what is it called? Bring what happened, what happened on the rock. Small thing. Raising Lazarus from the dead. Small thing. But when it comes to raising Jesus. From the dead. From the dead. Hallelujah. He had to flex his muscle. Ooh. He had to flex his muscle. He had to flex his muscle. He had to flex his muscle. Greatest miracle. Greatest miracle. And raise him from the dead. Why? When he raised Christ from the dead, you were raised. Man. Praise God. When Jesus was raised, you were raised. From oppression. Kandaba, Sakaraba. Sicknesses and diseases. I'm telling you anyway. Hallelujah. You were raised not just above, but far above. Amen. I don't know why. Praise you God. You were raised. And placed in a place of authority. Authority, anyway. Man. Is it? To enjoy those things. Yes, sir. That he, he, he for. And for wow. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. You are welcome to the popular program, Ego Christian Voice of Victory. Praise God. We are believing God for victory as the way tell in the name of Jesus Christ. Watch and do the things they are learning. Praise God. That's very important. That's very important. If you watch and don't do it, you don't work. You are just like the flying school. Hallelujah. <laughs> You go to flying school, there was a vision school in uh, in uh, there in those days, where they learn how to how to fly pilot pilot train. <laughs> they go to flying school. Flying school, you don't you don't fly a plane yet. You are doing theory. <laughs> and uh, most people are in, they remain in flying school for the rest of their lives. Wow. But when it's when you face challenges in life that you know that uh, just learning. Well, just learning and not doing it does it. We're not we're not we're not we're not, we're not, we're not <laughs> So. It's very important for us to know that you are in a flight school, but at the same time, as we, as we listen to us every day, you are in a flight school. But we have to do what we are hearing. Amen. Otherwise, it will not work. It, it, it's already working, but it will not work for you. <laughs> in fact, uh, let's, let's open, the, open our Bible to first um, uh, Luke 4. Luke 4, 18. Luke 4, 18. We are in flight school, and we don't learn how to fly. Luke 14 uh, is very instructive. Look at The Spirit of the Lord is upon me. Yes, sir. Because He has anointed me mm -hmm. to preach the gospel to the poor. Yes, sir. He has sent me to heal the broken hearted. Yes, sir. To proclaim liberty to the captive. Yes. And recovery of sight to the blind. Mm -hmm. To set at liberty those who are oppressed. The, pro f the proclaim liberty. Now, now, uh, I think the KJV is say preach, 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 preach. Deliver. Well, preach, deliver. Proclaim, preach. When, when people preach, they proclaim. You are supposed to proclaim or preach deliverance. The Spirit of the Lord is upon me. Yes. Because He has anointed me to preach the gospel to the poor. Yes. He has sent me to heal the broken hearted. Yes. To preach deliverance to the captives. And the covenant of sight to, to the blind. blind. So the first thing, what I want to go for that, go for that with it. What the reason is it? Deliverance to the captives. That's it. So. Now, the, we have many not people. Not to do deliverance. Not to do deliverance or pray deliverance. Or do, no, to do, do, do deliverance. Do deliverance. Now, 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 people are doing deliverance instead of pray deliverance. Preaching deliverance. Wow. Instead of preaching it, wow. they are doing it. Wow. You just say preach it. It's a contradiction of the word. Of God. <laughs> so that's why people say the same thing over and over and over again. Because they are not preaching deliverance. What we are doing in this telecast is to preach deliverance wow. to the captives. Man. And then we pray recovery of sight of the blind. See, pre the word pre you know, means to proclaim. You are a proclaimer, you are a preacher, you are a proclaimer. See, what we do as we preach this gospel, the Bible says the, Bible says the faith comes by hearing and hearing by the word of God. He said, how can they hear unless they, unless, unless they present the preacher? A preacher, a preacher has to be sent to do the job. He bring the, we are the, we are the one proclaimer. proclaimer to bring the good tidings. Amen. Of the gospel, of the gospel, of the gospel, like Jesus. Jesus so we, the, we see when you watch us every day on, the, on this telecast, and then you watch your life and see how your life is changing. 
because as we as we hear for good, as we hear this, you know, this is, this is just a very, very powerful one. You know, I started about it this afternoon before we started this recording. When I when we were training other, other a man of God, man of God train us. I have never, I never saw him if anybody that came under my late man of God, whose life didn't improve, wow. or whose life was worse, was was better before than when he when he came under under, under a man of God. <laughs> Their life got, got better. Our life got better. Amen. Your life got better. My life got better. Amen. Our sinner's life got better because we found the minister of the gospel. Amen. Who was kind and anointing of the Holy Ghost? Amen. See, you, are, you have no problem. You need an anointed man of God. Who is called an anointed? Amen. To preach the gospel to you. That's very important. Amen. So, here we are. We are here to preach deliverance. Amen. You know, many people, they are, they are trying to do deliverance for what they have delivered from. Wow. You are born again. Jesus has paid in full for your sickness, Amen. sin, disease, poverty, spiritual death. He has covered everything. Mm. Now, I, I, as I was coming just now, I was sharing, I was, listen, my message was playing in the, in the parlor. And I was listening, I was, I was telling a story of a young man who had a problem with cigar. Mm. It was a cigar, it was a smoker, a smoker. Mm. And he had a problem with cigar. He watched more television. I didn't even know, so his first t-shirt testimony. The guy has problem with cigarette. He has fasted, prayed, night VG, deliverance, deliverance, the service, oh, my drinking oil. All kinds of deliverance service never worked. Then she had, the guy had me preach simple gospel like this. Mm. You have been delivered. Mm. You shouldn't try to be delivered. That's it, because you've been delivered. And I, and I, you, you know, I, I, I also, I use the scripture in the, in that, in that message. In, in the first week, it has 6 verse 12. Six to years. He spoke about fighting the good fight of faith. Now, if you are watching us, you are in the fight. But it's a fair fight because you already, you already won the battle for you. But I'm going to show you your own part now. Your part in this faith fight is to use your mouth and your heart. Your mouth and your heart. You are not fighting to get free by your own power. You just have paid the price. Amen. Read the book, my Fight the good fight of faith. Yes, how? And Lay hold on eternal life. Lay hold on the air. For which you were also called. That's right. And have confessed the good confession. Before the ma of many, many witnesses. witnesses. This is very important, my wife. This is what you already nice. A summary of the Christian work and Christian wow. race. Wow. The battle has been won. Jesus has paid the price. But many believers are not aware. Wow. When the church is ignorant, an ignorant church is a defeated church. And that's why. An ignorant church is a defeated church. That's it. Not a triumphant one. No, 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 no. Because that guy was ignorant. I don't know how many years he's been fighting the cigarette smoking. Wow, wow. It was a habit that had that kind of to, to break free. To break free. I don't know how many years he has been fighting. And this is the to go. <laughs> you had a message on this kind of message on TV. Amen. Yeah, you are already delivered. That's it. You have been delivered. Amen. You have been delivered. Amen. But anyway, you have been, see if people oh, those are doing deliver ministry, it was say, no, no, you have been delivered. Amen. You have been delivered. No need to say, Ghost fire, Holy Ghost fire, come and kill your enemy. No, 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 no. Forget Holy Ghost fire. The Holy Ghost fire is not for that purpose. Amen. Yeah, I mean, now you have been delivered. Amen. Christ, Jesus has paid the price. Hallelujah. The full price. And anyway, Revelation 12, verse uh, 11 or so, is that same first when you see it right there just now, is in line with Revelation 12, verse 11, that we overcame by the blood. And, and they the overcame him by the blood of the Lamb. Yes, sir. And by the word of their testimony. And they did not love their lives to the death. Did you see that? Yes. Two things, by the way, that we are right now. Del you have been delivered. You, are, you, you have victory Amen. by the blood. Amen. By the blood. Hallelujah. I'm already a victor. That's it. Blood. By the blood. If you have a with uh, smoking, uh, marijuana, uh, drug addiction, uh, anger problem, uh, illicit sex, whatever represents besetting sin, that you have habitual sin that has held you bound for several years, you have been delivered. Amen. So now. Delivered from every enslaving habit. That's it. Unforgiveness. 
bitterness, and everything. Whatever represents enslaving habit over your life. Jesus has paid the price. But he said, we overcame by the blood of the Lamb and by the word of our testimony. That's it. So what does that scripture mean? It's very, the, that scripture is very powerful. It's, it's like eating dry fish. It, the more you eat, the more you fill your mouth. The blood of Jesus Christ did the job. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The ultimate price for the sins of humanity was by the blood. We were redeemed by the blood. We, you see, we were bought, we were bought, you are not born with corruptible seed, corruptible things like silver and gold, from your aimless conduct, but by the precious blood of Jesus Christ. So you have been redeemed from smoking. Amen. You have been redeemed from habitual pride. Amen. You have been redeemed from anger. You have been redeemed from, from illicit sex. We have we, we we been redeemed by the blood. Hallelujah. Praise God. And the Bible says, let the redeemer of the Lord say so. Hallelujah. That's your part. It's a done deal. That's, that's it. Amen. So your part is to use your mouth. It's to profess it. That's it. Profess it. Amen. Com- See, you read, you are saying we have. Believe it. And then, and then you, you confess it. That's <laughs> you see, you believe it and you speak it out. Amen. That's what gets the job done. Praise we have many people who are missing it. But anyway, that young man who was battling with smoking, he just simply took what I said on TV. Amen. And began to speak. Hallelujah. I have been delivered. I have been delivered. I'm free from smoking. That's it. I'm free from smoking. Hallelujah. I'm free from alcohol. Hallelujah. I'm not an alcoholic. Amen. I have been delivered. Deliver. That's it. I'm not ruled by anger. Praise God. I have been, I've been delivered. delivered. Praise God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I'm, a, I'm not, I have no emotion rules. Amen. I don't get flare of the handle by my emotion. Mm-hmm. I have beat over my emotion. So when you open your mouth, I begin to speak it out. Listen now, there is power of life and death is in your tongue. Amen. And the that you shall ask whatsoever you, you say. say. That's it. Mm-hmm. So what is the enemy doing, my wife? To get, see, right now, that all over the world, people are suffering. Uh, they, are, they are crying over it because of TV. Uh, they're reporting on the news about the, about sickness and disease. Uh, this is how many people just died in that country. Mm-hmm. People are all kinds of people, are, and people are feeding their eyes with that. They are spirit with those things, but anyway, mm-hmm. and and then they pronounce it. Mm-hmm. Somebody said, you know, this coronavirus that happened, so 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 so, so is going to is going to claim to so 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 number thirty-nine thousand lives will be claimed. Uh, they are already projecting how many how many how many people that will say that coronavirus will kill. They are, they are, Doing propaganda for the, for the devil. devil. Mm. They are not saying that this coronavirus is caused. Mm. They are not saying a lot of people are, uh, 80 to 90 percent of people are recovering. The people are, are recovering. Recovered. No, they are saying about how many thousand of still die. Yes. So people will now clear, they will say that 1,000. Yeah. <laughs> so you see, your, your, your mouth, that's why you are, all of you are born again believers right now. Don't be a part of those people. Amen. And are negative. No, my, my brother, you know, the book of James says the a sheep, as big as a sheep is, he says only small ruder, like a steering, mm-hmm. controls the direction of the sheep. Mm-hmm. Direction of the so sheep. Many containers, so many containers, so big, big things inside. But just a small ruder contains, but wow. just, just wow. that's a, uh, <laughs> Your mouth can do the work. Mm-hmm. You, you can dictate the direction of, of your life. You can, you can confess your way out of poverty. Mm-hmm. Anyway. Like you are doing those things, you are the children, you are the children, and everything you carry the children. See? Like you're wet and riches that you found in my house. Wet and riches are found in our house. The same thing with like, all this going on, Corona, 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 No shall come near my dwelling. No plague will come, shall come near my dwelling. With long life, God satisfy me and show me salvation. What if you are saying those things out of your mouth instead of confessing negative? Hmm. The devil has brought many, many mouths of believers hmm. and they're using it against them, using their mouth against them. Wow. But we see, this is the victory that overcomes the world, even our faith. faith. The victory that overcomes the world, sickness, and disease is your faith. Amen. And we are speaking spirit. We are speaking spirit. Amen. And when we say your faith, we're not talking about your faith in yourself, your faith in Jesus. Amen. You, say, you don't have faith in yourself. No, 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 no. Faith in Jesus, must be in Jesus. Not believe in yourself. Don't believe yourself. Don't believe yourself. Everything will be fine. No. It's in Jesus. <laughs> Amen. See, we overcame by the blood of the Lamb and, and the word of our testimony. That's it. So, if you take away the blood, your testimony is useless. Amen. Null and, and void. If you put the blood there and you don't have your testimony, it cannot work for you. Wow. Wow. Everybody I went to work today, they, 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 they just shed the blood for them. 
But they didn't know to receive. No. Either they didn't know to receive or they ignored it. The other thing, they are never how to add their testimony, but anyway, you don't know how to add their testimony to eat. Wow. But anyway, they are unable to add their testimony to eat. Amen. To affirm that they have been delivered. I have been delivered. Christ has paid the price. Amen. Yes. I believe he died they for me. Uh, yeah. From poverty, sickness, and, and disease. disease. Amen. Christ has paid the price. So Amen. now I can walk in I can walk in victory here and still go to heaven. Amen. Praise God. But some Christians they only have enough faith to get born again. Wow. And escape hell. Wow. But they are going to, to live they are going to live their life here in poverty. Mm. They will experience hell here and then go to heaven. Wow. And then you get to heaven, you discover that ah, so I will have been enjoying all these things here. Wow. Wow. And somebody traveling abroad and then they bought ticket. The ticket gave him permission to eat chicken and everything that is on board. On board. Every nice in the main. And they carry kuli kuli. And gari. <laughs> because he didn't want to incur any expenses. No, he didn't want to incur expenses. So he thought. I would able to pay for the, for the money, for the food inside the plane. Carry gari, carry kuli kuli, and carry gari. Yebu gari, yebu gari. And put the yebu gari where we want to do. And put the kuli kuli by the side. When they go around the plane, what do you want to eat? Is it chicken, chicken, or chicken, 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 or chicken or steaks? Chicken or steaks? You say, oh. <laughs> don't worry, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. Not me, not me, not me. Oh, yeah, you sure, you sure? Yeah, 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 yeah. You saw everybody around. You blink, it's a, it's a, it's a, you look at this head. I'm going to go and put this head there. Or you give me a little water. You put water inside this head. Put water inside. They go, they did that, that's it. But then you go to that side, I was a little like this one. You get blood, no, no blood there. So for one of his, the person has, the other person has, uh, pardon me, when they are coming out of the plane, they are about to land, I said, please excuse me, if you don't mind, I can ask you a question, so I say, why not go ahead? Why didn't you eat all this wine? You like this thing more than all the things you are eating? He said, oh no, I like those things you are eating more than this. Well, why didn't you eat it? I don't have money to get it. What do you mean you don't have money to get it? The same ticket you bought is what I bought. What? What? He lost out. Don't he lost out. This is serious. Somebody said when he was coming back from, from, from abroad, he was taking double plate. Double, <laughs> double, double, double ration. It's a sad that many people, they will die and go to heaven and discover that they will have enjoy good health. Wow. Healing. Healing and healing. healing. Provision. 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 Mm. Good marriage. Wow. Ooh. Peace. Like me, are you are enjoying that by the grace of God. Good Praise marriage. God. Some people now, right, when they say the corona day, nobody should come over the house. It is death sentence for them. <laughs> Like the story of one man in Italy, you, are, you, say, you say the man, say, the man say, it's better to get corona than, than to stay with his wife. <laughs> that his wife is worse than, it's worse than corona. He said, why is worse than corona? Wow. He said, go come out. He said, worse than corona. The man, the man, the man tell you, you know, like, if you want to let him die. <laughs> this man, he will kill him faster than corona. <laughs> so many people used to escape from their wives. Or was they, are, they used to walk to escape. They are cage now. And then they come, uh, they, they go out and come. They back. just come back and say, I come very late. Tip throw in the night. Tip they run out. Sleep at the window. They don't. Now come and say, You cannot. You see, they won't kill us. You see, people are stuck now, my dear wife, because they don't know that they can enjoy peace in their marriage. Amen. That Jesus has paid the price for peace. Hallelujah. He paid for it fully. That you can, just like you, you are laughing at you. Are, me and my, you can be laughing like that every day now. Amen. Praise God. Laughter. Praise God. Laughter. And when you laugh, then you, you see, like, like we shared in language shared last time, it will boost your immune system. Wow. By 60 by, by, to 60 uh, uh, well, That's paying tongues. Paying tongues. Boost and blah, blah, blah. But, but be, 10 belly laughs in a day, will, will, I don't know how many percent they are, but it will boost your immune system. I forgot, wow. I forgot about the percentage. Yeah, yes, yes. Wow. Praying tongues will boost your immune system for to 60%. Mm -hmm. Belly laugh. Belly laugh. 10 belly laughs per day. See children, when they are young, they, they laugh more than adults. That is true. Some of them say maybe four or five, I forgot how many four or times they did it, children laugh. Wow. And when they go to, when they grow, when they are really like teenagers, or they live like this in India, some of them only three or ten for them. I'm fine, thank you. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> thank you. When they grow, they are thinking about the, how old, how old to pay children's school fees, how old their wife abuse, how old their parents, how their wife abuse them. And I look at all the people and they're like, what is, what is funny? Why are they laughing? <laughs> on the one day, get upset with those on the one day, wow. wow. they just, just die like that, eat coffee. Wow. There's no strength. Wow. Wow. When you just pay the full price. Hallelujah. 
Make yourself laugh. Even you don't want to feel like laughing. Ha 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 it is, it is, it look, when you know what Jesus has done for you. Proverbs. I think 17, 22 or so. Check. When you know what Jesus has done for you, me and you will be in, nothing can move us. He mm. said, be of good cheer. He said, in this world, you are going to have tribulations, frustrations, distresses. He said, be of good cheer. He said, I have, I have, I have overcome the world. I and I've conquered it. Conquer it and I've deprived it. Of the power to or harm you. Or or harm you. So be of good cheer. Amen. Don't, don't look at the frustrations. Jesus says there'll be frustrations. But don't look at them. Look at the you can see what Jesus has done. Be thankful for the blood. Hallelujah. Read me the book. Anyway. Proverbs chapter. A merry heart. Yes. Does good. Like medicine. Yes, sir. But a broken spirit dries the bone. That's it. May I may I when the children were young, we should have what is confession? We see still have it now now for confessions. We have him in the morning. We have, 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 have, we 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 Don't be have, we 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 if only you can, your eyes can be open. That's why one of the most powerful prayers in the Bible, I think the most powerful prayer in the Bible is in Ephesians 1, 17 to 20. God is praying, God, the Holy Spirit is praying to, uh, to I mean, the Holy Spirit is using Apostle Paul to, to pray this prayer. For all saints, all born again believers, when I say sin, I'm not talking about Saint Abansi, or anything. Then once you are born again, you are a saint. He said, he said to the saints in Ephesians, Ephesus, he said, he said that the, he said he prays that the eyes of understanding be enlightened. Amen. First of all, that that there be out that you spirit, the God will pour his spirit upon you, spirit wisdom and revelation upon you. Amen. Read the read the Bible, verse seven to twenty. That the God of our Lord Jesus, yes sir, yes sir, the Father of glory, yes sir, may give to you the spirit of wisdom and revelation, revelation and the knowledge of knowledge of God. Not, the eyes of your understanding, yes sir, being enlightened, yes sir. That you may know what is the hope of his calling. Mm. What are the riches of the glory of his inheritance in the same? Wow. And what is the exceeding greatness of his power? Wow, to also believe. believe. According, According to the working of his, his mighty, mighty power, power which he wrought in Christ, Christ when he raised him from, from the, the dead, dead and set him at his, at his right hand in the heavenly places. places. Keep reading, keep reading, keep reading. Far above all principality. Yes, sir. And power. Yes, sir. And might. Yes. And dominion. Yes, sir. And every name that is named. Not, not only, only in this age, age but, but also in that, that which, which is to come. And has put all things and, under... And he, and he put all things under his feet. Under whose feet? And gave him to be head over all things to the church. Kandaba. Which is his body, the fullness of him, who fills all in all. This is a very powerful... We can almost steal this one to do a whole yeah. message. Hear me now, hear me now. Say, Jesus has, say, look, Jesus is the head. Me and you, we are his body. Born again believer, we are his body. You see, the Bible says he has put all things under your feet. Amen. Hallelujah. I mean, I mean, I have authority over them. My, my, she killed me. Me and you have authority over Satan. Hallelujah. We are authority over virus. Hallelujah. We are authority over disease. Amen. We are authority over every besetting sin. Amen. Whatever represents habit. Me and you are in authority. Amen. You are seated with Christ. Hallelujah. He said, he said, he said, he said he, 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 we are raised with him Amen. and seated with him. And he said, let your eyes be, uh, be enlightened. So you may know what is the riches of the glory of of his haters in the saints. Me and you. Oh, Masha Kalaba Baba. The exceeding greatness of his power toward us. Who believe? You see, that, that power was, was, he said, he said, which he wrought in Christ. When he raised him from the dead, that is the most powerful demonstration of God's power ever in life. Amen. No, pardon, pardon let's see. It's a smart thing. Uh, turning, uh, what is it called? Bring what happened, what happened to the rock? Smart thing. Raising Lazarus from the dead, small thing. He didn't take more. Well, Jesus did it. Jesus did it. But when it comes to raising Jesus from the dead, from the dead, Hallelujah. he had to flex his muscle. Ooh. He had to flex his muscle. He had to flex his muscle. He had to flex his muscle. Greatest miracle. Greatest miracle. And raise him from the dead. Why? When he raised Christ from the dead, you were raised. Amen. Praise God. When Jesus was raised, you were raised. Amen. 
from oppression, and sicknesses and diseases. I'm telling you, you are raised not just above but far above. Amen. Anyway, you are raised and placed in a place of authority. Authority, only anyway. way. Is it to enjoy those things? Yes, sir. That he, he, he Jesus, for. And for wow. us. Yes. But anyway, see, Jesus did the job. In the, in the garden, he was sweating blood. Amen. Somebody said, and my sweat, and my sweat, I get out of my sweat. Why are you sweating? What are you sweating for? <laughs> when you're already sweating, it. Amen. he paid the price. But anyway, By faith, you enjoy. You the, 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 that's it, that's it. He's, it's been provided to, by, 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 by grace. By grace. So you enjoy it by faith. Your faith takes it. <laughs> so now you need faith. Grace already provided it for you. But you are going to have to access it by faith. Amen. And what I will do on this telecast, Amen. we are building your faith up. Amen. We are building your faith up with the word. Amen. So that as you hear the word of God, they are, you see, this word that we are preaching is anointed. Mm. You, anybody can preach any message, you are just you are motivational speaking and everything. That cannot change anybody. But when you are preaching the anointed word of God, when you are preaching another word of God, you are not an anointed atmosphere like we are right now. Amen. We are anointed, right? We are anointed. Amen. We are anointed to, 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 not to pray deliverance, but to preach deliverance. Amen. We are preaching deliverance to you that are here captives by the enemy. Hallelujah. Praise God for that, my Lord. So you have been delivered Amen. in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Now, if you are not born again, it's time, it's time to get born again right now. Amen. So say this prayer after a minute. Say, Dear God, Dear God, I believe in my heart. I believe in my heart. I confess in my mouth. I confess in my mouth. Jesus, Jesus is the Son of God. Is the Son of God. I died for my sins. I died for my sins. Right now, right now, I'm born again. I'm born again. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. 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 Praise God. Praise. God. Hallelujah. Amen. You believe, you receive. Amen. You believe, you receive. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Now, if you are sick, that signal has been taken by Jesus Christ. Amen. So, tell you what you are hurting. Be healed. In the name. In Jesus. In the name. In the name of Jesus Christ. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We are looking for a living church. That we are not that we are not a church. Amen. And get and 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 and, and grow become strong. Your next time. Right. We'll we'll